My name is Candace Day and I'm one of the professors in the Digital Film Production Program at Sioux College. It's a two-year program and we cover all aspects of the filmmaking process. So we have courses in screenwriting, in uh, production, in post-production. Um, I teach uh, courses in um, pre-production planning, um, so creative development, the producing side of it, the business side of it. Uh, I also teach uh, classes in directing and dealing with actors and, and as a director how you get your vision on screen. Um, I also uh, teach our portfolio classes. Uh, so I work with our students in a setting that is similar to um, an industry style production meeting um, where we develop short film projects and the students work in groups um, and they create short films. So when our students graduate, they'll have a portfolio of uh, short films, commercials, maybe music videos, uh, as well as uh, pitch packages. Um, so we, we, we develop episodic style shows um, for streaming or television and uh, in an industry style pitch package that you could go out into the world and pitch your idea to, to a production company or a broadcaster or a producer. My name is David Patterson. I'm one of the professors here in the digital film program at Sioux College. I teach uh, post-production classes as well as production classes. The, the, the goal of the program is to uh, show students enough about the different, the different sides of the industry to at least have a sense of what they like and what they don't like and where they'd like to start. And the idea is to get them uh, enough skills to start an entry-level position uh, somewhere within the film industry. My name is Carmela Cochamilio and I am a faculty member in the Sioux College Digital Film Program. Um, I love guiding students through the process of creating their ideas and putting them down on the page to create a visual story and then Seeing it come to life, that's the other part of it for me, is that I get to guide through the students through the initial process of making their story. And then um, as students move through the program, they get to film the scripts that they wrote for me. And so it's just, it's magical for me to see those words on the page translate into films on a screen. I think one of the best parts about the program is that it's a small community college. Uh, the classes are small, so the students get a lot of one-on-one -on -one time with the professors. We really get to know our students. They have access to a lot of gear. Uh, it's a really nice kind of community feel. Um, we're also able to work with our students very closely to help them get their first jobs uh, and help them navigate their, their first steps in the industry as they start their careers. Uh, we use the Adobe Suite, so within that, over the course of the program, we use Adobe Premiere, uh, we get into After Effects, Edition, a little bit, we get into, of course, Media Encoder. Those are the main ones that we use with, the, with Adobe. We do also, uh, later on, take a look at uh, DaVinci Resolve, which is an editing and color correction uh, program, and Avid as well, which is another sort of industry standard uh, video editing uh, software. As far as cameras that we use, uh, we have the uh, Canon uh, C200, uh, which is a cinema-specific um, digital camera. So uh, any of this, the gear that we have in the program, students are more than welcome to take out and to use um, for their own uh, projects. We also have an, an editing suite, uh, which is a dedicated room uh, with five separate uh, editing uh, stations at it. Uh, and they're enclosed from each other, which is nice, so you, the student gets their own room to work in when they're there. Uh, and there's also some, um, some that specialize in some things. For example, one of them has uh, uh, an audio recording booth in it for doing voiceovers or uh, re-recording actors or even recording music. Another great advantage for students is that they have the opportunity to work on actual sets. Uh, we have major films that come through Sault Ste. Marie to film here and so we're constantly looking for opportunities for students to be connected 
to those real uh, industry experiences. We've sent students to Africa on behalf of the college, Barbados on behalf of the college. We've had a student uh, who's out in Vancouver now working on you know, Marvel movies and VFX on set. Uh, we've had a number of students who have gone to Toronto, but even ones that just um, stay locally have uh, managed to get themselves onto films that come, uh, come to, to this town, but, but also regional ones. They're able to go and go to other parts of northern Ontario or even travel around the, the province or country to, to, uh, to take work um, through the contacts they've built uh, during their time at the program or from, from the working experience. The great news is that right now uh, the industry is exploding globally and there are tons of jobs, uh, really interesting jobs, so it's a really, really cool field to be in and um, there are opportunities for everyone. It doesn't matter what your skill set is, there's a place for you in the film industry.